This is Jamie Salter's home away from home. For 36 years, he's been employed by Mondelez at Cadbury's factory in Hobart's northern suburbs. So 35 years ago, I started here in what we call the crumb plant um, as an operator and obviously got the opportunity to work my, my way through um, the business. So from operator to safety manager, quality manager, um, now the manufacturing manager. A family-friendly workplace which didn't just foster a love for chocolate. Jamie also met his wife here. Yeah, so from a family point of view, we've got around 175 years service between us all. Um, obviously my father was the first um, soldier to work here, so he was here 49 years. This year, Cadbury is celebrating 100 years of operation at the iconic site. From wrapping chocolates by hand to hands-off automation, the processes to make our chocolate have undergone major changes, improving efficiency and in turn sustainability across the board. It's good to see all the changes, like coming from the old site to here, like, yeah, yeah it's really good. You can see how much quicker it runs and how much easier. Technology is really underpinning a sense of purpose for our workforce. Uh, we invest heavily and we have a clear roadmap on the way in which we want to continue to uh, engage our workforce. Staff have had to adapt with the times. They are highly skilled, trained in how to manage state-of-the-art technology. Upskilling um, our, our staff um, starts with retention. Um, you know, we have a fantastic team uh, and we're performing exceptionally well and and that starts with our people. I think that's one of the biggest things about Cadbury's at Claremont is the family tradition, but people being proud about their product. Um, even now with Cadbury's made in Tasmania, you can see on the wrappers, that's a big thing for people that work here. It makes them put pride in their work and, and makes them very passionate. Time has brought other changes, a focus on sustainability. Mondelez International reducing its carbon footprint using wind power and recycled content in its packaging. It's a major step forward with the site producing around 62,000 tonne of chocolate product this year. Global customers with many ingredients sourced on the island. Look, it's something we're incredibly proud of. We source over 120 million litres of milk from 40 dedicated farmers in Tasmania. It's a vital piece of the Tasmanian economy, but it's also contributing to jobs, uh, to tourism and to a secure and stable supply chain in Australia. Cadbury contributes around $412 million to the Tasmanian economy each year. And over the last 100 years, uh, it has provided jobs for people, hundreds of jobs, not only here in Hobart, but uh, right across the state, up into the far northwest corner. They're in for the long haul. They're investing in their plant and equipment and their people to ensure that they can be competitive and meet what the community and the workforce expects of them uh, as a major employer here. Cadbury chocolate is a sweet recipe, combining state-of-the-art technology and a dedicated workforce. And we know that when we get those two things right, we create the magic um, that is Cadbury Dairy Milk.